Hello guys, there is Vitek from AppWaiter Interactive and today I will show you how to implement ads in Android game. There will be a banner and you can display video ad or rewarded video ad which add you coins. Now this is simple video ad and this is rewarded video ad and if you close it you receive a coins. As you can see it's working perfectly and now I will explain you how to do it. Firstly, what to do, click on window, go to general and to services. So in services you will select your organization if you have someone and then you create a project or you link it to already created project. Uh, now I don't have a new project so I will create one. Now I created a project and then go to ads. Turn on ads and Check this if your target age is under 13. Nice. Uh, let's enable test mode because now I will explain you it in test mode. And go to Unity dashboard. There is my project called Ads Tutorial. You click on it. Go to Monetization Placements. There is App Store ID and there is a Google Play ID. Now copy that value. If you are using Google Play, copy this value, and if you are using App Store, copy this value. Now in description, I will add you to download these free scripts. They are simple. There it is. And in each script, there is a game ID, and there you place the values from Unity Dashboard. It's done. Let's go back to Unity Dashboard and there is a video and the rewarded video. Now let us add placement and add the banner. Click on the banner. Create placement. Let's go back. And as you can see this is video is ID which we must put there. This is banner ad and we named it banner. So we must write banner rewarded video rewarded video and video. It's interstitial at now it's done. Let's go back to Unity, go to asset store and find Unity monetization. It's this. It's free. Just you download it. I already downloaded it and now just import it. Select all and press import. Now it's done and as you can see there is no errors now. Uh, if you add the scripts and add services uh, sometimes it's needed to restart Unity. If it's underlined red or there is some other error, just restart the Unity and it solved this case of problem. Advertisement in Unity is there is true. As you can see, it's bool test mode. If you write a true, you can test it, and if you write a false, it means it's a for relays. So just for relays, because if you use it for testing with false here. It can give you a ban for ads. So for testing, always use true. And before realize, change it to false. Uh, that's all. There is method show banner, which show the banner, and there is a start, which contains show banner. So if you start this scene, it automatically show the banner after start. Now let's look at the interstitial ad. There is method show ad, which show ad. So just call it and it will show at and there is a show at 2 in the rewarded video at now let's create a game object call I will call it at controller and I will add these components banner at interstitial at and rewarded video at there you can set the position now I will use the bottom center now let's implement it. There is, I have two buttons. 
one for video add and second for rewarded video. So add the action on click, place there add controller, and there is a video interstitial add and call the method show add which show the add. Go to button on, on click there place add controller and after click display interstitial add and call method show add which the which call this method but it's showing a missing because this is a static static method and static method cannot be called from the button so just copy this remove the static and show add click rename it now let's edit it go to button interstitial add show add click and now it's all right now let's add the video, watch video button. So we do the same. There is a show at. It's a static. So we can call it from anywhere. Now I'm in a game and I would like to call the at. So I will just reward the video at, show at. And that's all. You can use everywhere. It's so easy. Now let's copy this and right click. And remove the static method now we can add it to button click so add it here add controller place here rewarded video add and show add click now we have implemented it and now you must choose which reward you want to add there is a reward this is reward. I write it. I write this. You don't have this in your code. This is just current coins from NASA in first coins text. So it's zero. So this value is zero. And in new coins, we plus 10 coins per video. And to text, we will display the new coins value. It's simple. We can also debug it. We can write reward and make sure your game is set to Android or iOS if you are developing for iOS. Now let's take a look at this. Yes, there is a banner. If we click display video at, video at is displayed. And now if I press plus 10 coins, now look at the console, it's empty. And if I will close, there is a reward and we will edit 10 coins. It's easy. And if you want to release a game, just go to test mode and there a uh, checked for test mode off. Now it's a real ads and if it's checked this, it's test ads. So this and after releasing it onto Google Play or App Store, just add the package name here. Don't worry if the, your game is not showing, because it will be available after a few days. So, if game does not showing, just wait a few days. Also, after realize you can add it to add mode if you want. It's just right there, IDs. You choose video, this is rewarded video, and this is banner. You will name it same as at the unity. That's all. Then go to Operate Dashboard Unity Data Export and there you will create the FK, copy it and go to there, Add Source and you will paste here, then Organization Core ID you will pass here and you can see your ads in Edmo. If you have some trouble with this, if it don't work, feel free to write me. If it was helpful, like my video and also subscribe to get new tutorials. You can share this video to all people who use Unity and good luck in your game development. Bye.